Don Dollars Pro Jr. It was like the Alfred E. Newman of Wild. Wild was a fanzine. It was a little magazine published by high school kids. What Wild was was our attempt to be like Mad Magazine. But it's this weird character. It's this Dagwood hair coming out of the side of his head, like in the comic strip Blondie. Then he has a flat top. And then his eyeballs, the whites are black and the blacks of the eye are white. And I don't know. I don't know what that means. <laughs> but years later, that was in like 1960, 61, 62. And years later, Art Spiegelman and I were in uh, the Hotel Earl in New York doing probably wacky packages or some Topps bubblegum card series. Art lived there and he worked for Topps and I was in town uh, working for Topps and we had to do this really fast and they got us a hotel room and uh, when we finished doing the Topps stuff we were doing also comic strips for the East Village Other, the underground paper. Out of nostalgia we decided to revive Pro Junior and for some crazy reason we put him in a jungle suit and then Crumb saw that and he said well who is this guy why is he wearing a jungle suit and I showed him all the issues of Wild and then I published Bijou Funnies and Crumb did a story about Pro Junior in a jungle suit you know and after a while uh, Dennis Kitchen published the whole book of Pro Junior comics where Every artist does pro, his version of Pro Junior. It's called Don Dollar's Pro Junior. So I did the cover, and I think Crumb did a story, and Justin Green did a story, and I did a story, and my friends did stories, and then Dennis finished the book off and got his cartoonist friends to do stories. What did it mean? Why is he wearing a jungle suit, and why are the eyeballs white instead of black? What is the meaning of this, you know? I read a critique of Pro Junior that what it means is he's a proletarian son of working class parents, and that's what Pro Junior means. But, you know, all I thought it meant was he was an amateur cartoonist who wanted to grow up to be a professional cartoonist.